Hey, what's up, YouTube? Okay, so today you're gonna go with me on an adventure. Aren't you? Okay. I am cutting my hair today, right? Random. I have really bad heat damage, and I'm just... It just needs to get cut off. There's nothing... Okay, I would... I'm not gonna put myself out there. I just took my sew-in out. I don't even want to put myself out there like that right now because I have still half of my hair braided and my stylist is probably going to be pissed at me because I didn't take my sewing out last night, but I'm cutting my hair, so stay tuned. Okay, I'm cutting my hair today. Obviously, you can see all this ratchet heat damage. <laughs> bad, bad stuff. I know I'm looking crazy right now, but we're gonna get there, guys. <laughs> it's a process. <laughs> they will not have you out here with nappy roots, though. <laughs> It's fabulous. That's all. That's what it's about. But can you show me something more than what all the dudes bring? Hey, what's up, everybody? It's Forever Rick here, and here is my new haircut. I went ahead and just cut off all the heat damage that I had obtained from going to the salon one time and getting my hair flat iron straight one time. I'm letting you guys know it only takes one time to straighten your hair for you to get heat damage. It took me two years. You guys saw I cut my hair off two years ago. It took me two years to grow it out. I wanted to just see how long my hair was and I got heat damage. So, as a result, I just went ahead and cut it off because healthy hair is more important than length. You know what I'm saying? A lot of people are asking me, why did you cut your hair again? You grew It grew out so long, but, or you could have just wore sew-ins and braids and stuff to grow it out until it grew all off. But I love healthy hair. I love my thick mess. <laughs> and there, I just couldn't deal with the two different textures, so. Went ahead and chopped it off. It's only hair and it'll grow right back, I promise. So, peace and love. Hope you guys like it.